Hey guys, Nate and Stacy here with 21st Century Nerd. Today we'll be showing you our first video here, Cosplay on a Budget. And today I'll be showing you Last Minute Misty. You'll need some shorts or some pants to turn into shorts, a yellow t-shirt or a tank top, some red sneakers, red suspenders, Bodge Podge, and red hair. And this is Bertha here, modeling a lovely red wig. If you have red hair, you'll be fine. Otherwise, you need some type of red wig or hair dye. And just a little scrunchie. Um, put it up in a scrunchie. The scrunchie's on the left-hand side here. I did kind of a more relaxed ponytail, because for lack of time. But if you have more time, you can put it to the side more, spike it up, use some gel, make it a little more anime, misty-like. I just bought a basic t-shirt at H&M. It was $6 or two for 10. So I just tried on the shirt, found out where I liked it to lie on my body. Then I pinned it, cut it across, and I used a sewing machine just to sew the bottom down there. Um, it's rolling up a little bit because I did not use elastic, but once it's on there with the suspenders, it looks nice. If you do not have a sewing machine, you can actually use some glue. Uh, they have fabric glues. They also have some that you just ironed adhesive. So anything like that works fine. Very simple, very easy. These I got at Abracadabra, which is a costume store. Um, they also have the thicker ones, which are a little more accurate to Misty. I just thought the thin ones were a little cuter. If you do not have a costume store conveniently nearby, you can just use um, basic elastic. Uh, red elastic would be better. If you have white elastic, you can just paint it, anything like that. Um, but yeah, there you have it. And to make the shorts, I actually used a pair of pants that I had. So you can see here, just took some scissors, cut it straight across. You don't have to be straight, anything like that. Just cut it however you can, as fast as you can if you like. Roll them up, just like so. And there you have it guys, some lovely Misty shorts. So I took the extra scraps from the t-shirt that I had. I cut the bottom of the hemline so that I had a nice thick even line. And I actually put some Mod Podge on both the back of the strip here and onto the shoe directly. Then I just placed it down, pressed it nicely, and did that all the way across and for both sides there. And then it says to let it dry for two hours with the fabric Mod Podge, but I just let it dry overnight. And there you have it, folks. Misty on a budget. watching the video. Hope you guys found it useful. My name again is Negative Stacy. Uh, you can find more of my work at www.negativestacy.com. <laughs> also on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Bye guys.